briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 2005, the United States Court of Appeals for the Fifth Circuit heard Chiris v. Miller, a case centered on the government's right to choose educational materials as part of its policy. When the Texas State Board of Education refused to approve an environmental science textbook authored by Chiris for state funding, both Chiris and a high school student named Rodriguez claimed violation of the free speech clause of the First Amendment. The district court dismissed the case, asserting that school officials could discriminate based on viewpoint when selecting classroom materials. The appellants, Chiris and Rodriguez, challenged this decision in the Court of Appeals. The State Board of Education held the responsibility of adopting and purchasing textbooks for Texas schools, with each proposed textbook voted on by the board. Ultimately, the court determined that the rejection of Chiris's textbook was classified as government speech rather than private speech with government endorsement. As a result, Chiris was denied access to the board's approved textbook list, and Rodriguez was unable to force the board to select specific textbooks. This ruling upheld the government's authority to select the most suitable textbooks for public schools, emphasizing the importance of government speech in educational policy. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.